Number eight, Miami Floyd men's basketball got destroyed tonight by number 12, Kentucky, 95-73. to 73. I thought this game would be close, and probably many other people thought did as well. But Kentucky said, hold my beer. I'm going to just not. I'm going to just dominate this game. And what's crazy is, in the first half, it was close. 42-37, to 37, but the second half, that was a big start difference. 53 points for Kentucky, 36 for Miami, Florida. And now Miami, Florida has the first loss of the year and everything. And Miami, Florida didn't shoot the ball terrible. I mean, 44.1% from the field on 59 attempts. But 26.3% from the three-point line on 19 attempts, that's not good. 76.2% from the free throw line on 21 attempts. 35 rebounds, 12 of those offensive. 8 assists, not that great of a number. It needs to be better than that. 5 steals, that's good. So it could be more. 1 block. 15 turnovers, that's way too much. 15 fouls. And you did have 23 points on, off the bench. And you had 3 double-digit scores that combined for I think it's 29, 49 points. And if you want to include like seven points or more than one other player, eight points. So not really a lot of help there. Now, Kentucky, on the other hand, had 38 points off the bench, which is insane. And they shot the ball too good in this game. 59.7% from the field on 62 attempts. 42.9% on threes on 21 attempts. 70.6% on free throws on 12 attempts. 29 rebounds. Yes, they got a rebound, but they were making a lot of shots. And six of those offensive but 26 assists, 9 steals, 5 blocks, 8 turnovers, 18 fouls, maybe too many on the fouls. And Kentucky did have 5 double-digit scores in this game that combined for, I guess, 25, 43, 64, 76 points in this game. And they did also have like one other player with 7 or more points in this game with, with 9 points from somebody else. So they had a lot of balance. And I expect my in Florida to drop because of this loss and Kentucky to move up because of this impressive win. So what does Miami Florida have going next? I mean the next five games. They play North Dame, they play Long Island, they play Colorado in the M A B C Brooklyn showcase, which I believe that is in Brooklyn. But I want to just double check that. Yeah, Brooklyn. New York and Colorado was ranked. So that's not necessarily an easy game, but you never know. It says to happen. Of course, LaSalle. And then Stony Brook. But Stony Brook does one, the one and six. But then again, it says to happen. So that's just to name some games right there. And now Kentucky for the side of things. They have the following games. They got UNC Wilmington. They got... Like Penn and Malone's Classic, which will be played in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. So, at Penn, yeah. They got North Carolina in the CBS Sports Classic. That's currently number 19, I mean 17 in the country. So, that's another good test. But Penn was a team that actually beat Villanova. That's ranked. So, you can't overlook. And it's in Atlanta, Georgia, by the way, between North Carolina and Kentucky. So, then Louisville. And if you want to include one more game, like Illinois State. So, anyways, if you like this content, like and subscribe. And see you guys later on the road. 600 subscribers. Of course, ultimate goal is 1,000 more. So, make money out this course. Like the video, comment video. really helps YouTube algorithm. So, more people can see it. Sharing the video does as well. So, more people can watch. And if you're watching and not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. It's free. And hit the notification bell as well.